these two countries here at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. Who will make a statement in this, the opener? Stay with us, we'll have every kick of the ball for you live next on EA TV. Good evening and welcome to Alcor, welcome to the Al Bayt Stadium, the venue for this one. I'm Derek Ray and my commentary partner as always is Stuart Robson. And both teams looking to get off to a flying start here on match day one for them at the 2022 FIFA World Cup. It's Argentina and they take on Australia. Well thanks Derek, this is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope to see some great football today. The Argentina first team. Emilio Martinez is the goalkeeper. Rodrigo de Paul starts alongside Leandro Paredes in central midfield. And leading the line, Lautaro Martinez. And the starting 11 for Australia. Well, in this shape, if their wide players stay high up the pitch and get enough of the ball, it's a very attacking lineup. But if they drop too deep, they will then leave the centre forward isolated, and it could be difficult for them. is underway and with that the attack fizzles out well you always feel there's a bit of extra pressure on Argentina going into the World Cup it's been 36 years since last they lifted the trophy but can they produce the sort of well flinging himself at it Delivering it, well, did his job defensively. Options in the middle. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. I mean, let's face it, when Messi is on the pitch, you cannot take your eyes off him. What do you think he'll offer in this game, Stuart? Well, for me, Derek, his greatest attribute is his ability to combine with teammates, particularly in tight areas, in and around the box, clever little one-twos, little passes around the corner. He's the player that could be key to breaking down this defence. And behind it's gone for a corner. It's a short one. Deflected behind, corner forthcoming. Playing it in, well, not the best clearance. Good work to win the ball back high up the pitch. 
Can he do it to take the lead? And the keeper did magnificently. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? <laughs> Who can he pick out? Well, not cleared away completely. Threat over for now, it seems. Space on the flank. Happy to take on the shot. Could have been awkward for the goalkeeper. The corner courtesy of Lionel Messi. Well, the only way to say it is he got it all horribly wrong, Stuart. Well, he has to make the keeper work harder than that. That's a tame finish. Really good high press. And it's Messi going forward. What's he going to do next? Messi looking for the through ball. Can they put it away? Di Maria. Now with Paredes. Well, tremendous block. Marcos Acuna and showing fine vision. Able to deal with the threat. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Oh, he's given the ball away. Well, Argentina have really started to dominate the play over the last 15 minutes. They're creating plenty of chances and looking a constant threat. You feel they have to take the lead at some point with this sort of domination. Yes, it's so true. For once, they find themselves in defensive mode. And he cuts inside. Now well, able to close down the short. And a good take under duress there. Read it superbly to take back possession. Rustic. Always going to be the goalkeeper's ball. Celso De Paul and that pass could be troublesome he might profit from here you know and the keeper has denied him well I've got to say Derek he was always in control of that situation brilliant stuff fired over by Messi what an absolute waste of a corner and he keeps going Rodrigo de Paul is with Paredes. Now the managers will now deliver their half-time team. And now they get the ball rolling. Well, flinging himself at it. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. De Paul. Lionel Messi. Oh, he's given us away. Good win. Going well, must be, it could be up for grabs. Oh, he's given us away inexplicably, and keeping it out. And the short option preferred, and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. And plenty of scope to be creative in that wide position. But they took care of the situation defensively. Goodwin. 
Moy. Still passing it around with authority. Well, play stopped. It is a free kick. Well, straight into the meat of the penalty area. Well, they do like to press whenever they can. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Martinez. Really poor timing, and some will argue that he was asking for a yellow card. Well, he's gone into the referee's notebook. And he can't be surprised. That was a poor challenge, you have to say. Ball back with Australia here. Romero. Now well Molina. An Australia throw coming up. Really good high press. A goal! On the back of sustained pressure. Now they deservedly hold the advantage. Well, as you can see, he beats the defenders so easily with a change of pace, and then it's a decent finish. That's a very good goal, you have to say. Good win. Well shown inside, but they dealt with the threat first. 20 minutes remaining. Gives it a go! And that's a straightforward stop. Bad pass. Jackson Irvin fine teamwork to win it back Aaron Moy well nicely cut out now what can they do with the ball Giovanni Lo Celso Messi, he's in behind. A good and fair challenge. Breaking at pace. Well, there's still scope for late drama here. Five minutes left and just one goal between the sides. And it'll be a throw in for Australia. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Chance to cross. Very quick thinking there. Marcos Acuna. Good visualization and execution. And they couldn't quite muster a real threat. Decent position. Aydin Hrustic. Boyle. And it goes into the history books as a win for Argentina. A very satisfactory outcome. Stuart, your analysis. Well, Derek, it was very competitive. Chances at both ends, but I feel they were the better team and they deserve their victory. But in the final analysis, Lautaro Martinez did his job. What did you make of what he put into the game? Well, he was excellent today, and he gave them that all-important lead. They just struggled to cope with him. His movement was so clever.